we get to attempt this again. Oh, you're not. Oh, you don't get your start at your checkpoint. Nope, because I got I got kicked back to the main menu, so there is no checkpoint. Man, the frame rate seems kind of low right now. Yeah. And apparently, I decided to do that for some reason. I could have gone down there and got the other check. Oh, right. I think you actually have to detonate the bombs. Or at the very least, you have to detonate the lower bomb, because otherwise you can't get to the gold dot. Because it's surrounded by spikes and all that. I am surrounded by spikes. <laughs> I'm being so random. Get the checkpoint, dude! I'm getting bonus tots. <laughs> because I don't know. Lots of points! And I got rid of them. Yay. The blue ones. I never liked those blue ones anyway. What's my favorite color? I know. Which makes it annoying when they're trying to kill me, so. Yay. Now I have to wait for this. Someone can remix that, seriously. The Spin Doctor remix. <laughs> Although I think Spin Doctor might be a band. I'm not entirely sure on that one. A band or a song or something. I believe there's a song called Spin Doctor, yes. So it sounds like a remix of the, of the song. Oh no! Oh, 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 Careful! Gosh. Yes! There we go, that was close. Wow, a lot of bonus dots here. Yay! I guess, I don't can know. The, can the bomb destroy hourglasses? Uh, probably. I don't, we'll actually, I don't think you can, because for it to be able to destroy the hourglass, you'd have to have the hourglass right on top of the bomb. Oh. So, actually, I don't think so. Man, Although I just cut myself! Ow. What? <laughs> I just cut myself on my desk. Sounds like a, that desk needs checked out. <laughs> that sounds like a work hazard. <laughs> okay, now I just have to get through here. And I can stay safe over there, so yay. Yay for exploiting the edge of the screen. <laughs> yay, light the fuse! And bounce. And around the edge. And I'm safe over here. Yay, safety! But you're not forever safe because... Time limit! Yay! You're never safe in Slender. Slender. You really should play it, you know? The closest thing this game has to Slender is the acid dots. <laughs> yeah, you can't make it over there, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, I have to... Go like that, and then yay. Ding! Yay, more points! As if that mattered. Wow, 18 lives. This is usually what my lives look like in the early early levels of Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> oh, you hear this? You get in... a bunch of extra lives, but then you end up using them all later anyway. They give up in Super Mario 3D Land. They give up extra lives like they're candy. Like, seriously, like at the like at the end of the game, I have like 127 lives. <laughs> I'm not getting game over anytime soon. Oh uh, gosh! Isn't this also the game that offers to let you skip levels if you're having trouble with them? Yeah, if, but only on but only on the first eight worlds. In the secret worlds, they don't give that to you. Like let's see, if you if you if you die ten times. On a regular world level, you get an admits you get a suit that gives you that gives you complete and total invulnerability except for falls. So you can literally go up and touch enemies and not get hurt. Oy, Mario, it's, what have they done to you? It's the white it's the white raccoon suit. And then if you if you're still struggling after 20 lives, the game just goes, okay, you're really having trouble. We just want you to succeed. So here you go, have this P wing instead. You know what the P wing I wanna is? I want to see what happens when you keep failing with the P wing. <laughs> 
where they, the, just, where they, the, they just keep they just keep giving you the P wing. <laughs> the game eventually says, "Man, you can't do it with this. I give up. Stop playing." I remember I kept failing at a level in Modern Warfare Three campaign because because I didn't because I didn't know that I had a second gun. I thought that it was that, that I had to keep using my LMG, my my passion egg. I thought I had to keep using that. So it would take. So the scripted event was you fall through the roof. And you take your gun out, and this guy comes, rush, rushes at you with a machete, and if he hits you, you automatically die, because in that game, melee attacks automatically kill you. <laughs> even if you're a juggernaut. Even if, because you play a level later, you play the final level in that game where you're a juggernaut. Yeah, that, that part's kind of broken. <laughs> yeah. If you I'm in a juggernaut suit. <laughs> what the crap. <laughs> yeah, if, yeah, you get, if somebody hits you with their shotgun, but you die. But if they shoot you with the if shotgun. If they shoot you with the shotgun, yeah, you, then you're fine. Just don't melee me, and I'm invincible. And in multiplayer, it takes it takes multiple knives to kill a juggernaut at one time. <laughs> it takes it takes I believe it takes three knives. Just not when you're a juggernaut, because that would make the game not. No, broken. if you're no, if you if you're a juggernaut in multiplayer, you, it takes you it takes you either a, 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 however many shots for you to die, or a grenade to explode near you, or three or three knives. So it's just single player that's broken. <laughs> yeah. Really. I, 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 at least I don't know. Does does it take three knives? I don't know. Multiplayer, oh, you might stupid. die with only one knife. I'm not entirely sure because the knife is an instant kill. Dang which, it! Which, which I keep doing these stupid deaths. Oh gosh. Wow. Fail. 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 There's got to be an easy way to just zoom through this. <laughs> Somewhere, and that wasn't it. <laughs> I have so much foreign currency. I'm not being random now. The game went away not random. <laughs> ah! Come this on. Level seems to be, this level seems to be very hard, squirrel. And I did the same thing again. Wow. Okay. And then after. Possibly several game overs, or at least one, I don't know. Let's do this thing. Once again, yay for editing magic. Yay for friendship, because that's magic too. Oh dear. Ah! I have a friend of mine who's a... Who, he put, his avatar is a picture of Sonic and Rainbow Dash at the same time. Yeah, at least that kind of makes sense. Actually, you know what? That's that. Uh, now that I think about it, that makes a complete and total sense. I think they would get along perfectly fine. <laughs> Sonic and Rainbow Dash would get along really well. We no. Oh. Ah. There's got to be an easy. I know there's an easy way through this. Just no. Blar. Yeah, I don't even know what my exclamations mean anymore. Ah. You should do a Let's Play of Castlevania. Oh dear, I don't think I'd get past it. <laughs> like, I think I, I tried I, I, live so can, streaming so that once. So we can hear a constant exclamation of how Soma, how Soma Cruz only gets a pocket knife to fight against all these monsters. Oh, you mean that Castlevania? Yes, that Castlevania. I was talking about the original one. I tried to stream that. Uh, well, I did stream it. Can you stream I... Jet Set? Can you stream to Jet Set Radio? Uh, my computer can barely run that. <laughs> oh come on! I should probably I could I could probably stream. I try recording it and it's uh kind of slow. Yay! There we go. What about Vindictus? <laughs> <laughs> Vindictus. And wait. Oi. Oh what right. The, wait, I lost. The I skipped to the next level because this was a level where I got uh, a lot of game overs and lost lives on. So, uh... What the hell is up with these wands? I mean, what the heck is up with these wands? Yeah, um... You can see why this level gave me trouble. Because, uh... This pattern is insane. You gotta prepare for trouble, Doubt. Chernara. Prepare for trouble. And, and make ones? it quadruple. Your no, those blue ones make it make. Yeah, those blue ones do make it. Those blue ones make it triple, actually. Make it triple? I don't know. D 
Duh, this, this level. I just got past it because I got lucky somewhere along the line and just... I don't think I can replicate it. <laughs> do you think, do you think these walls are trying to protect the world from devastation? Do you think sure they're th uniting all peoples within their nation? Do you think they're denouncing the evils of truth and love? To extend their reach to the stars above? And I don't really know after that. <laughs> oh, I can think of something. Uh, white wand, enemy wands, team wands. Well, if they're, if they're really trying to unite all peoples within their nation, they're leaving the white wand out of it, aren't they? <laughs> True. And there should be a green wand, and all, and all combination colors that they're formed with. <laughs> At least I got to that checkpoint. <laughs> Man, if I included all the footage of me trying to get past this level, you, you guys would be sitting. You, you guys would be Ooh. sitting here for a while. Oh man. Yeah, if I included all the footage, you people would probably be sitting here for more than half an hour watching me try to complete this one level. At <laughs> least. <laughs> that was a big uh, this was frustrating. Oh my gosh. Hey! Oh no! By the way, remember that Chuck Testa meme? What? Remember Chuck Testa? You don't know Chuck We're... Testa? Oh my gosh! I'm not being random here. Let's focus on the game. <laughs> anyway. Last life. Uh... Yeah. You can do it. 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 I'm gonna. Yeah. Oh jeez. Yeah, that wand bounced. Thank heavens. Yeah, uh, my reaction at that point was something like, either, yeah, or... Because <sighs> I did not want to do that. And this is one of those levels where I don't know how you're supposed to time this. Because, uh, you barely get enough time to go through it. Yeah, see? Look at that. Alright, here we are, final stretch. Let's fail till we win. <laughs> Makes sense, right? Lag! Ah. I think that was actually when I was recording this. <gasps> my computer decided to act up because... Oh my heavens, what's going on? doesn't help when you're trying to time something like this to have your computer suddenly lag. Oh, jeez. Man, what's going on here? I guess my computer wasn't... So, yeah, uh... You have to time this perfectly or you die. You have to be, like, frame on. See? That looked like I made it. <laughs> it's... It's insane. You can go the opposite, the harder direction. Uh, I tried that. That was like uh, a lot of lives I spent trying to do that, and uh, uh, it's really, really, really difficult, if not impossible, to go the other way. And besides, it's still hard to get through there. Mm -hmm. Trust me. This is another level where. It took an insane amount of retries. Kind of wish I'd kept count just to say how many times it took me to do this stupid thing. I once disabled frame limiting on my on one of my emulators. Oh, there we go. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> yeah, everything started running at 90 frames per second. So yes, everything was Man. smooth. But I'm sure it's a lot of lag in this video, isn't there? <laughs> and yay. I kind of reacted late to that, but whatever. <laughs> yay, how got past are, that how after. How many levels are there again? 106. You're almost there. We're halfway there. 
<laughs> halfway. The first half is much easier than the second half, let me tell you. <laughs> Light the fuses. Light them all. <laughs> Explosions. Whoa. That was close. Oh, there go all the bombs. Now, how do I get... What the heck was that? Ah, oh, fail, fail, fail. Fail, quail. Fail what now? Fail, quail. I don't know. That was a phrase, that was a phrase me and one of my friends used to have. Fail, quail. Eh, those days. You destroyed a couple wands. Yes, that should make it marginally easier. Oh my gosh, no! Eh. Hey. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, well, at least this game doesn't mock you for your failures. That would make it even worse. <laughs> Another one. I guess. Oh. What? That was. That was pretty late right there. Oh. No. Oh. Well, I'm sure I'm getting pretty good at lighting all those fuses quickly. Although it really probably should be timed better if I want to take out more wands, but. Oh well, whatever. <laughs> I just want them out of the way so I don't get killed by the stupid sparks. I never had a bomb kill me, but that spark. Whoop, there we go. Woo! Oh goodness, okay. At least there's no red wand to worry about here. Just hanging out while I wait for the spark. We oh. Oh well. Checkpoint. Yay for checkpoints. Hey, hey beat that one. Yeah, you notice something like, oh, Space Quest doesn't have any checkpoints. <laughs> Space... Oh, poor, yeah, poor Roger Wilco. <laughs> Wait, what? No checkpoints? That means you have to start from the beginning when you die? Well, no, you can save whenever you want to, but, you know, you can make the game unwinnable and you'll only know it hours later. That's always fun. Through your actions? Yes, and you might not even realize it. Actually, you definitely won't realize like, it. How can you make the game unwinnable? Um, I don't remember which Space Quest game it is, but there's a Space Quest game where you trade uh, money for a hovercraft or something to, get, or a spacecraft or something to get out of an area, mm -hmm. something like that. Oh, yay! Beat that one. And if you don't trade, and uh, well, no, the the first trade, if you just go for the first trade, it'll actually make the game unwinnable. And you won't know it, and you might, you probably won't even know that that's the reason. <laughs> what, well, what does it do? Now you what have to do with the end. You have to reject the first offer, and the dealer will throw in a free jetpack or whatever, and that jetpack is what you need hours down the road. Yeah. So Good luck figuring that one out. <laughs> so if you don't, so if you don't, so if you don't reject the first offer, you you take the second offer. I mean, if, if you do, if you don't take the, if you don't take if you take if you take the first offer, how does it exactly make the game unwinnable? Because you need the jetpack to get past something hours later. <laughs> and what and what happens if you get to that point? Do you automatically lose? 
No, you'll just figure out that there's absolutely no way to get past what you're doing right now. It doesn't outright tell you the game's unwinnable, it just is. Because uh, Sierra is horrible like that to you, because it likes to troll you. <laughs> and yay, more dying. As I try to figure out what in the world the pattern is to this thing. Yeah, it looks like I was getting it. Looks like I'm getting it a little, maybe. I just gotta make it the rest of the way. <laughs> ah! Nope. <laughs> Alright. Let's keep going. Yay. This level again. Because I still don't know what the pattern is to this thing. Much less how you're supposed to get all those bonus dots in the middle. <laughs> Good luck! This Lugia is wondering if they will give him a free filet of fish tomorrow at McDonald's. <laughs> fish. <laughs> Actually, those are good. Boy, a fish never had them. Oh well. At least I think because good. because because this loot because the, this Lugia prefers um uh Whee. prefers beef I guess chicken. Well, I like burgers. Uh, McDonald's burgers depends on the mood, I guess. <laughs> what do you What do you normally get? Not the chicken nuggets, that's for sure. <laughs> I, Not because I don't like chicken. I do like chicken. I just don't like their chicken nuggets. Because <laughs> they're kind of weird. I, we... I think they're great with ranch. There's that level. I don't know, I like uh, Let me get chicken it. sandwiches or like Wendy's chicken nuggets or something like that. Yo... But you guys are missing one thing that we don't have that, that I should have shown you when you were here. in and out Burger. <laughs> it was actually rated among one of the top best burgers in the U.S. Oh. Oh, come on. That should have killed that stupid acid dot. You can actually kill it if you... Uh, it, oh, and it... And it went. Okay, it just jumped off the screen. That works. <laughs> da. That is what is called a missed opportunity. <laughs> I think the strategy I had here is to try and kill the acid dot by killing it. Was it jump? See? That killed the acid dot, but I died. If you jump off of the temporary dot as the acid is latching onto it, then you can actually kill the acid that way. Yeah, like that. Oh. It's kind of tricky to pull off that timing, though. <laughs> that door is open. Last door is open. Wow. We. Now we wow, just this is a check pack of a long fuse. <laughs> yeah, that fuse is just crazy, and it's annoying because you have that stupid spark going around the entire time. Yay, checkpoint. Can you just stay on the perimeter of this now? Uh... Probably... Well... No, see, I have to detonate that bomb with the short fuse over there to get rid of that spike. And then I have to go all the way back and go to the gold dot. So this one's kind of a test of attrition. Because <laughs> it takes... Because, yeah, you have to detonate that, and then you have to go back around. Because, yeah, see, that gets rid of that spike, and then you can go Same. through. So, yeah. And there's nothing to bounce off of over there, so while I was waiting, I had to keep reversing. So I can just be on that checkpoint, so I can detonate that easily if I die. Ow. Like now. Yeah. So I can hit that and then just start trying to go back because it's going to be detonated way before I get there. <laughs> oh no. Oh gosh. So is it just me 
Or is, like, people failing? Is that just funny? Or... Depends on what point of view you're in at that time. <laughs> Usually you failing isn't nearly so funny. Except when you look at it in retrospect. Sometimes, yes. <laughs> you know, like, I did that? Oh, I'm such a klutz. Wait, why did I go on there? Well, it is safe, so I... So I could have planned my next move or something. Uh, but I didn't. Because derp. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? I don't know. Oh my heavens. This is painful. Oi. I bet I would never get the hang of yeah. this game. Well, you can always find out if you have an iPod or iPhone or something. <laughs> yeah, it's an app. And yes, it has the levels. Wow. I'm not so fortunate. I have an Android. <laughs> I have nothing to say on that because I've never used one, so I'll refrain from like saying anything bad about it because I don't even know. <laughs> Besides, there's plenty of bed. Oh, I trapped myself and then I died. No, wait, I didn't trap myself. I could have gone on the blue dot. Whatever. Okay, so I didn't trap myself, but I still died. Ooh. Da! I almost had it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there we go. And I trapped myself. That time I really did. <laughs> because of the wand. Acid. It's that one acid drop that makes things a little bit more difficult. Whee! Now we wait a little. Now. Go around, open up the door, maybe. Yeah. Wait for an opening. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yay. What the heck? This part isn't... My phone says I'm somewhere different than I really am. <laughs> oh, no. Mm. Oh, this almost called recoil. Yes. Do you recoil in um... horror? I'm not, yeah, I'm not quite sure what the significance of that name is in this one. Other than the fact that you have to go all the way around and all the way back, I guess. <laughs> That's the only thing I can think of. That, yeah, recoiling in horror, that, that works too. Because it's not as bad as 98, though, because you had to ha be super precise to get through that stupid door. That shouldn't be necessary. <laughs> that kind of timing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I keep having to kill the stupid acid. Acid should not... This is this is a good thing to you scientists. Do not try and study sentient acid. It will end badly. Sapient? Or maybe not sapient. Sentient is a better word. Yeah, hopefully acid doesn't become sapient. That, that's too intelligent for acid. But then again, if it was intelligent, maybe it would be better. Because, yeah, sentient, it might just chase you and try and melt you. Because, I don't know, the acid requires food now. I don't know, this sounds like a plot to a bad sci-fi story now. I'm just warning you now, scientists, do not study intelligent acid. I don't even know how that would work, but don't do it. <laughs> Nanobots, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> Heck if I know. I'm not the crazy scientist, so... <laughs> so whatever. <laughs> we. Okay, let's hit that bomb. <laughs> Set them up the bomb. All your... All your wands are belong to us? I don't know. 
I can't make a zero wing reference out of this. <laughs> How's it supposed to go again? Good evening, gentlemen. All your base are now belong to us. Good evening, gentlemen. All your base are belong to us. <laughs> they have set us up to the bomb. You have no chance to survive. Make your time. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Something like that. But the game itself is for a scrolling shooter. Not, it's not all that bad, actually. Everyone just remembers the horrible translation. <laughs> the very literal translation, I guess. There's another one. I once saw a web picture of a of a funny of a funny um of a funny translation. Uh, it was something in China. They wanted to translate this, the sign. But there was a translation server error, but they just thought that that's what it said in English. Oh, gosh. So the sign says something in Chinese, and the next one in English, translate server error. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Boy, that'd be confusing for the English goer there. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, great, the computer errors are spilling into real life. Darn those Digimon in the digital world! <laughs> Yay, and finally got past that. That level was really... Oh, dear. Ooh. It's like an industrial plant. I suppose I could have gone around that. <laughs> Whatever, you wanted the bonus dots. Ooh. Ah. And I managed to impale myself on the door as it's opening. Uh, this is what I mean by perfect timing. This is just like level 98 all over again. Uh, I wonder what the heck the wands are made out of anyway. What uh, sound plasma, do they make? Maybe? I have no clue, and I don't think anyone does. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anyone cared. Well, checkpoint, yay. So, bonus dots because I can. And because they're just sitting there. I suppose if I had the right rhythm, I could probably time my way right through those really you, quickly. You, you've got an extra life, good sir. Ooh. And, ooh, that was, wow, that was really close. It's like, <laughs> nope. And then I'm going to stay away from the door while it's opening. Because, yeah, that red wand down there is controlling that door. You don't have to have good timing to go through the yellow doors, though. Those that one, those yellow doors in this one are easy. Yay! It's like 11 seconds left, so lame time bonus. <laughs> but who cares? And the last level is 106? Yes. So we're close. Yeah, the moment you step off of those dots... Yeah. That was quick. Yeah, I kind of got lucky there. But yeah, moment you step off the triangles... <laughs> caffeine rush! <laughs> Which is why it's Tr called Frenzy. Sugar oh. rush! Wreck it round! This, this there are level. no clear dots here except for, except for the one you start on. Yeah, uh... This level is also extremely frustrating. Another one I got several game overs on. So yeah, um, the gameplay time of the all the uh, clips I have is like three or four hours, but uh, this game took much longer than that. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Maybe you should try going around the bottom. I don't know. <laughs> Actually, no, the bottom would be harder. Yeah, I think... Maybe. I don't know, the hardest part is the very last part, actually. <laughs> Timing that just right, because there's so many ways to mess the last bit of it up. By this point, I had a decent strategy of how to get through... No, wait, no, I didn't. This is the first time I started playing through it. So, actually, this would be after the cut, and I would have a decent strategy for getting through these parts. But yeah, I'm kind of getting lucky in surviving so far on there. Because <laughs> of their pattern of flipping instead of swinging. So 
Looks like I almost have it, but oh. no. I was close. And then I'm probably. I wonder, I wonder if Clockworks is, yep. is abandoned where. Oh, Clockworks is definitely abandoned where it's old. Although the. I'm not sure if there's a PC version called Clockworks, but there's a PC version called Ultimate Spin Doctor, which is Clockworks. So it's, so it's basically Spin Doctor 2. Basically. I found the graphics in Clockworks kind of weird, though. The it, whole clock hands thing. I find it. I find it. I find it odd that that you can port Windows onto Apple computers, but that you can't port Apple onto Windows computers legally. Uh. Yeah, the, you're talking about the boot camp thing, right? Where you can boot in Windows on a Mac. I'm computer. talking about dual booting. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I was getting at there. You can't do it on Windows, though. <laughs> Not without a lot of hacking, anyway. They call it. They call it Hackintosh. Yeah, yeah, that's the term for it. And it's not. Yeah, it's possible, but it's a lot harder. <laughs> but, yay! Lucky for me, I have a Macintosh because there's some Mac OS 10 games I want to play. Uh, are you sure you can run it on that compu on that computer? Please, I'm talking like 2D stuff. No. Well, there is some 3D stuff, but any 3D stuff would be that I'm thinking of so far, anyway. You know, you could go for the, for the for the bonus dots near where you started. Uh, I'm, I'm at this point. I had like five or six game overs from this level. I just wanted to get past this level, get it over with, and go to the last level. On, on pre-med, when everything's moving slower, this this level's so much easier. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. okay, slight technical issue, but yeah. Anyway. I don't think mice and technology really get along that well. They like to chew holes and wires. Ah. What kind of stereotype is that? <laughs> well, I have a human friend... Did you have a bad experience with mice? Is yes, that one of them. Yes, from? one of them chewed. One of them chewed a wire in the br in some brake wiring of my friend's car. That sounds malicious. <laughs> it's your fault. <laughs> my fault. Do I look small enough to chew through a blade through a brake wire without being detected? That would be silly, to say the least. <laughs> oh, you get it. You have it. You have it. You have it. You have it. You... Uh, no! Oh, gosh, no. <laughs> that was so close, too. Uh, How I... Yeah, this level's insane. Would this be like... I, th I, I just get lucky and find a way through it. Which is... I'm pretty sure it's pretty soon. Pretty sure it's pretty soon, but that's kind of redundant. <laughs> Oh no, 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 no! <laughs> aye, aye, aye. So, you know, you remember in Star Fox 64, the raccoon guy that would, the, the tutorial raccoon guy that would just talk in like, like, uh. like, 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 like little, like he wouldn't have a voice, right? Be yeah. Like, little, uh, like clicks or whatever? Yeah. He has a voice in the 3D, in the 3DS version. <laughs> to charge you laser. Oh. Release it to fire. Release it to fire. A charged laser. Yeah, he's actually got a really cool voice in the 3DS version. Huh. Uh, no! Oh. Yeah, I don't know what that means. <laughs> Whenever I make a weird noise out of frustration, I don't know what it means. So don't bother Pretend asking, you're being because I don't Henry know. Gilman. Mm, oh, by the I'm way, there's, trying, actually, but... there's actually someone in my class. His last name is Gilman. I was like, <laughs> I was like really? Oh, no. Was like, really? Gilman? Oh, <laughs> uh, that's, that's funny. Like, kind of awesome. <laughs> like, I wonder how many people... I wonder how many people, like... I wonder how many times the reference wow. comes into play for him. Yeah, I do kind of wonder. But like you, Lamont, right? Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? 
<laughs> All right, more more dying time. Yay! Yeah. Uh, spin doctor style. I don't spin know. Spin doctor style. <laughs> doctor style. Oh gosh! Yes! Yes! Yay! Yeah! There we go. Yes. Maybe it was a Gundam style awesome. that did uh that that, that uh. I guess that out. did the trick. I don't know. Is the last level? Yes. Oh. This one actually looks harder than it is, unlike the some of the other levels. Although it, it you need is to still open the hard, door. But... Yeah, I forgot to open the door the first time. Herp a derp. And also being an idiot and swinging through there, I should flip to reduce the number of acid dots that are chasing me. Which is why this level is called Pursuit, because there's going to be a bunch of acid chasing you no matter what you do, so... There is that. Except I guess you can't call it Hot Pursuit. I don't think the acid is hot. It might be hot. Ooh. It could be an exothermic reaction. Is hell endothermic or exothermic? <laughs> Here. <laughs> that was an amazing. That was that was an amazing response. <laughs> it's like, wait, what? No. <laughs> go go go! Oh gosh! Um, no! No checkpoints either. Harsh. No. Oh no! There's one like right near the exit there. I don't know why there's only one near, right near the exit, but whatever. <laughs> there's one, and you probably don't end up beating it anyway. <laughs> Because you're right there. Although, I guess if you died right near the exit, you'd be glad that that checkpoint is there. Because otherwise, you'd have to do the whole thing over again. <laughs> and that would suck. Oh. And you don't get a whole lot of time either. Yeah, but if you don't go through the level quickly, the acid's probably going to kill you anyways. So, you know. Oh, gosh. Move! Ah. Ooh, yay! That that was pretty cool right there. Keep going. You're on a you're on a roll. You're on a roll. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to find a way to get through there. Oh yeah, yeah. There we go. Oh no! <laughs> How'd that acid get there? Oh. No. <laughs> of course, the acid popped up like over there near the exit. You were doing, like, you were doing so well. Crap. It was that acid. The acid messed me up. <laughs> we go around the red. And... Yeah. And go through here the way I did last time. Oh. I failed doing it. Dang it. You it was so right, awesome last right time. I just went... Shh. Uh-oh. It's right on my tail. I got enemies on my tail. You yeah, actually you can't shoot them down. Use bombs. Use bombs wisely. What bombs? I wish I had bombs. Oh wait, you there left is them bombs. behind in the other levels. There is bombs, but you don't get to carry them around. I guess they would be too heavy. I don't know. Especially for your uh, weak little white wand. That dies because everything. <laughs> my friends, my friends and I like to come up with an excuse. Because something happens. It's because it's all Jade's fault. Because Jade. I like to come up with excuse plots for pretty much every single game I play. Why is this weird random thing happening? I don't know. Let's make something up. Yes, I killed that acid. You can do it. Checkpoint. You can do it. Yay. Uh oh. Oh crap. Uh oh. Good thing there's a checkpoint, I guess. Because that would have been frustrating. And oh, ah. denied! Come on! Right, 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 right. And, and yay! You did it. Yay! There's the game. There's all 106 levels. Now give me my victory party, Spin Doctor. I deserve it. Whoa! And then they do this. <laughs> What's going on? They decided to put as many sparkle effects as they could on the congratulations screen. Yay!
And there's all the levels that I show off all the levels there, just in case anyone cares at all. And that is Spin Doctor. And just for comparison, I guess I pulled up my pre-med scores for some reason. And yeah, it does keep a separate profile for whoever types the name in, so there is that. Yours, and I had the distinct pleasure of presenting with you, Ray Brand out. And Tanara Kurinov signing off. Until next time.